This short video will provide you with an overview of what closing costs are involved when purchasing a home. So what are closing costs? Closing costs consist of all fees associated with a home's purchase or refinance beyond the cost of the necessary down payment paid to cover the cost of the transaction. Costs will vary from state to state and can also depend on the type of financing you have arranged. Closing costs can range anywhere from 1 to 4% of the price of the home. The loan estimate, also known as an LE, is a document that contains a summary of estimated closing costs. All lenders are required to provide a customer with a loan estimate within three days of completing a loan application. In addition to providing an estimated amount for closing costs, the loan estimate is also a tool customers can use to compare offers between lenders when shopping for a mortgage. Loan costs represent the lender's charges for processing and closing a loan. These can include fees payable directly to the lender, as well as fees charged by a third party but passed on to you through your lender. Here are some examples of loan costs you may see on your loan estimate. Fees paid directly to the lender may include origination fee, application fee, processing fee, underwriting fee, points. Fees charged by third parties may include an appraisal fee, a flood certification fee, a tax services fee, and a credit report fee. The closing agent will also charge fees for services provided for your home purchase transaction. These can be fees charged by a title company, escrow company, or an attorney, depending on the state. Some examples of title and closing fees may include a closing or settlement fee, attorney fees, title search fee, title insurance fee, and fees for notary services. In addition to loan costs, there are other costs associated with a home purchase. Recording fees and transfer taxes are examples of government fees. These fees vary by location with the amounts determined by and paid to the local city, county, or state where the property is located. Prepaid items are items connected to the transaction which are required to be paid in advance and are collected from the buyer at closing. Examples of prepaid items include one full year of homeowner's insurance to be paid upfront, upfront mortgage insurance depending on the type of financing, prepaid interest which is interest calculated from the day of closing through the end of that month, Property taxes, depending on when the tax bill is due and payable. Property taxes are typically prorated between the buyer and seller to the date of closing. An initial escrow deposit if taxes and insurance will be included in your monthly mortgage payment. Other costs that vary per transaction may include items such as inspections, optional attorney fees, homeowners association fees, if applicable, or a home warranty. Ultimately, closing costs vary based on the type of loan being applied for, the type of property being purchased and its occupancy, your credit rating, and local customs. Responsibility for these costs also vary, with buyers paying some fees and sellers paying others. Remember, closing costs play a significant role in the overall expense of purchasing a home. By understanding and preparing for these costs, you can avoid any surprises and make your home purchase experience a smooth one.